They're calling it a creepy encounter. Two teen girls say a van stopped them as they were walking in their neighborhood. They live in the Hertford Village in Raleigh. That's where we find CBS 17's Kelly Kennedy. And Kelly, they're rightfully shaken. Yes, so both of these teen girls, they were, they were walking down this block in their neighborhood when they were approached by two men in a tan van. Now, reports were filed, and Raleigh police are investigating. They've been patrolling the neighborhood here, but many people who live here say they're still worried. 18-year-old Wake Tech freshman Emma Wisnett loves to take walks around her neighborhood, but lately, she's felt a little less safe. I think they wanted me to be a prostitute. It was mostly just panic. It's just like, this is really creepy. It was just, I just kept telling myself over and over again, you'll get away. A couple weeks ago, Emma was walking to a friend's house. That's when she says the driver of a tan van pulled up next to her. They circled back around and pulled up next to me and started asking me questions. I didn't respond. I, I pretended like I didn't hear them, didn't know they were there. Um, they started getting a little more, like, they sounded a little more aggressive. Um, they were just like, come on, give me your number. I can help you make money. It turns out Emma isn't alone. Elizabeth Infante says her 16-year-old daughter had an eerily similar experience last week I get a call from my husband basically telling us to um, that we need I needed to get out of work to hurry up and go home because my daughter was approached by a sex trafficker Infante says her daughter was walking home from high school she says the circumstances were similar to the other story Infante tells me it wasn't until another neighbor came near her that the van took off for it to happen more than once with the same mo it's kind of shocking like we have to really be very careful with our kids. Now, as I mentioned earlier, Raleigh police have been driving around this neighborhood patrolling the area that mom tells me neighbors are also pitching in. They've even offered to walk her daughter home from her nearby high school so she feels a little bit safer. For now, reporting live in Raleigh, I'm Kelly Kennedy for CBS 17 News.